Hello, my pretties. It is Thursday. I'm a little late coming home. Had to stop and kind of see the doctor a little bit. Just having some pain. And it's not like me to complain about medical issues. But it, you know, when, when I notice something, I have to speak up. So yeah, that's what that is. And, and it's, as of right now, it's nothing. But let's get into what I have today. I have the second to last mystery box. Oh, this is not fair. Um, before I get into that though, let's get into the informational portion of this video. For anyone who is new here, hi, I'm Gladys. On this channel, I mainly do unboxings. Uh, Ipsy, BoxyCharm, FabFitFun, Pacitori. Uh, a stitch fix and on Tuesdays I do what is essentially a get ready with me but I do it silently uh, and I call that my mind time I also do whenever I get a chance and the holiday season is a huge chance for this it is mystery boxes I love mystery boxes more than all of the subscription boxes I get. Why? Because it's a way to try something new and it's the best bang for your buck. I love mystery boxes so much. I do mystery box giveaways. I kind of curate my own. I have my normal one over on that side of my room. Um, that will start up in January. I have a special holiday one over here um, just for you guys for the holiday season because I want I want to give and I want I want you to feel special and happy and and be like oh, look at the gift I got um, this giveaway will go on until December 15th, which is Tuesday. <sighs> wow. Tuesday. Just because I want you guys to have it by Christmas. Um, if you're interested in that, I will link the starter video for that right up here. If not, it's okay. Um... For anyone who is interested in seeing more from this channel, more from me, more, more mystery, I uh, do all those things YouTube would like you to do: like, subscribe, hit that notification button, even though it doesn't work half the time, um, and join our family. If not, you can just move on to the next video. It's okay. You're not gonna hurt my feelings. I am old enough. I can take it. With that said. Let's move on to what I have, our normal programming. Sorry, just have to take a little breather. But in this box right here, I have one, it doesn't, they have like, I don't know, so much stuff in it, it doesn't sit flat. It just, it's just rocking. Uh, but this is from Urban Decay. And it is not the most expensive box, but it's the second most expensive mystery box that I got. I didn't even know they had this. I guess because of COVID, sales are not what they normally are. So they're not really advertising it, but they still have it. And they have multiple different versions of their mystery box. It is kind of pricey. It is $99. But, and I thought, ooh, 
Ow. Let's not tell my husband. Uh, but how, you know, the only saving grace is that it says that it will have two full-size eyeshadow palettes in here. And well, uh, I feel as Urban Decay is a bit overpriced. But giving me two palettes is, is, is definitely worth it. So let's get in here. And it says that it'll have a value of, I'm trying to remember, $182. So here is everything. I see what I want right there. So let's get in here. First, we have this. I don't know what it is. It's a makeup bag. Oh, no, it's not a makeup bag. You have this little baggie. Right, it's real plain. But what's inside is a pair of Skull Candy headphones. You've got some spikes over here. And it says, <gasps> wow. And they're Bluetooth headphones, big ones. This would make such a great gift for someone. Wow. I didn't mean it. Oh. And it comes in with this little bag to put it in. I think that's amazing. I don't know what this has to do with makeup, but it is amazing. So first makeup item is one of their vice lipsticks in naked i have quite a few lipsticks from urban decay oh it's a nude color i don't know what i have i have so many i have quite a few so we get that Next item is the Urban Decay Perversion Volumizing Mascara, full size. I have tried this. I don't really care for it. It's just a little too wet for me, for my taste. Not that it's like, you know, I'm just, it's for my lashes. When I last tried this, it would just get up here and down here, it was just, too wet. So this is going to go in your box. Shut up. Not, I don't have two palettes. I have three palettes. This is one of the smaller ones. This is the Urban Decay on the run palette in, in bailout. Oh my goodness. Ooh. You got a purple here and a purple here and the rest are Nude, I would, yeah, nude, but not bad. Like if you want, if you weren't like a fan fan of purple and wanted to try right here, you have two, a sparkle and a matte. You could give it a try and you know, without going too far, but I love purple. I feel like this is kind of balancing out the Gerard Cosmetics one. My next one is the Naked Heat. I actually own this. I cannot show you the packaging because I depotted, but the packaging is one of the things that drew me into this palette. Don't worry, the package of the actual palette is plastic. But here it is. I mean, it's so pretty. The like 3D effect. And these look like matchsticks in the pack. It does come with a brush and a mirror. And here it is. You get some, you know, this gradient of color, which is really nice. I did enjoy this. 
so since I already own it, this will go to you guys. And the other one is, I wanted it, but I didn't want to spend the money for it. And I wasn't sure if I was going to get it. And I did. It is the Naked Ultraviolet. Oh my god, I wanted this one. By the name, you can probably guess why. Oh, look at that packaging. Oh. Another palette I would have loved to have gotten would have been the stone palette. Ooh, glitter, sparkle. Ooh. Do you see why? I love purple. So you got some nudes down here. You got this baby blue right there in the center. Oh, can you imagine that inner corner? And then you have some blues. This one kind of down here is like a blurple, yeah, a blue purple. And then you got like a gray purple over here. <laughs> I want to just touch it, but I don't want to. I gotta wait for my time to do that. You guys probably already know which one I'm gonna keep. It will be the Urban Decay Ultraviolet. And look, $99 was a lot of money. You made it up with, oh. with three palettes, a small one and two big ones. I mean, these big ones are like $52. You have a lipstick full. And then these Bluetooth headphones. Okay, so you guys are gonna get the smaller purple palette. And you're gonna get the Naked Heat. You're gonna get the per perversion mascara. I want to say persuasion, and you are gonna get this lipstick in naked. It is a cream finish, and I don't know what to do with these. I really don't. You know, my kids didn't ask for any headphones. But maybe they do need one. I don't know. I don't know. And does this have any real value? Because it was made for Urban Decay. I don't know. Let's see. No identifying marks information on there. But that is it. What do you think? I mean, it's a pretty good ending to these mystery boxes, right? I have one more left to go. Uh, it is in New Jersey, so I should get that any day. And then hopefully by the weekend, I'll be able to like condense it all and get it ready for the winter. Uh, with that said, have a good night. I'll see you in the next one.